Hey, greetings from the print shop. I got uh, a few things to run by you uh, here before we get out done with our spring break. Um, and I'll get around to that in a second, but I want to say um, I hope you're all doing well and uh, that you're uh, settling into a long uh, corona apocalypse. Um, that being said, I have made Corona Apocalypse printmaking kits for everybody. They are here in the print shop, and um, I'll go over what those are right now. So uh, this is going out to all uh, the printmaking students uh, in Screen Print Litho and the printmaking workshops, and to the drawing students. So. Let's see what I got here. For all of you who are in the screen printing and litho class and ready to screen print, as well as those of you who are in the workshops working on screen print, I have made, I believe, enough of the uh, presses for each of you to um, take one home and uh, work with it in your home studio uh, for the, the rest of the semester and even the summer for that matter if you promise to bring them back in, in the fall. Um, here is a little checkout sheet. You can see some people have already come in and got those things. Uh, for all of you, and I'm going to read off uh, this list in a second, I have these kits made up. This kit includes some uh, screen filler and drawing fluid. And um, here is all of the white ink, black ink, extender base, and transparent base that I got for the class sort of to use for this semester. Um, and I'm going to put this up here for each of you to take um, some of this home with you. Please uh, note that there are 18 people working with screen print and so you can't take a bunch with you. I think if you each brought in a small yogurt container um, and uh, put some white, black, extender base and trans base in there, um, that would be enough for everybody to have to take some home. It might not be enough for you for the semester depending on how much printing that you're going to do, but so you might need to order some. I got these from Blick. Blick is still shipping, no problems at all. So whatever other stuff you might need, get from them. So there is also a, I got five sheets of Fabriano Unica printmaking paper uh, for you to take with you uh, to print on. So this is a pretty heavy duty uh, student grade printmaking paper, but I do like it actually, it's a good paper. What I don't have for everybody is a degreaser and you're gonna need this in your home studio. My favorite degreaser is Greased Lightning. Um, uh, I'm out in the shop, but I did pick uh, some stuff up for my own uh, home studio from, uh, I think it was Lowe's or Home Depot uh, a day or two ago. They also have it at Walmart and at uh, the True Value hardware stores. And they have them in spray bottles. You don't need to buy a gallon. You're not going to need that much. Just get a spray bottle worth. It's about $3, $3.50 or something like that. But they're extremely helpful in cleaning your screens, especially when you don't have a power washer, as I'm assuming many of you don't. Um, okay, so these are the students that I got these uh, screen, making, screen printing kits for. I'll read through them real quick. So I got Agatha... Naya, Logan, Cannon, Leah, Janae, Alexander, Aiden, Ross, Allison, Brody, Thaxter, Davis, Nate, Alec, Daphne, Davis, Erica, and Brittany. So um, come and get this stuff, please, when you can. Um, so for those of you in the workshops who are working on other things, specifically more relief stuff. I got uh, some uh, relief printmaking kits for you. I uh, have this uh, uh, super graphic black Bill Fisk Speedball. This is an oil-based ink, but it's water miscible, which means it cleans up with soap and water. Maybe a little bit of simple green in there too to clean up, but it is a great ink. 
um, and a roller. So these are for you to keep in your home studio to take with you and, and keep in your home studio. Um, and there is some MDF here. I've got uh, three quarter inch MDF uh, and uh, this drop off that's been sitting around for a while, this half inch MDF. Um, there is some shellac here to seal the top of those boards. And uh, for each of you, I got uh, five sheets of Unryu uh, rice paper. Um, and so really beautiful stuff to print those woodcuts with. What you're going to need, obviously, is a spoon or a baron to print with. So I'm hoping you all have a wood spoon at home you can steal from the kitchen. Um, let's see. Oh, the uh, people that I got these for are Alex, Ali, Dahlia, Tiffany, Jess, and Caleb. Um, let's see. I got for uh, the Advanced Drawing Workshop students, uh, you all seem to be working in water media, so I got 140-pound uh, Arches Cold Press Watercolor Paper. The good stuff, 16 by 20 sheets, five sheets each. Verda, there are 10 sheets here for you because, um, no wait, there are five sheets here for you, never mind. Uh, my counting is, is not that great. So uh, the way that I'm going to uh, take the uh, paper home is I'm gonna roll it up in uh, some, some blue paper here to keep it clean. So I'm gonna take five sheets for myself and um, I'll lay it like this and, uh, and then roll it up uh, so that it is all covered and stays nice and clean. I'm gonna do, I would do that for the uh, uh, Fabriano Unica as well. A couple of other notes for you all. Um, I would recommend that you get yourself ready to print uh, and work uh, creatively at home for the duration of the semester. Uh, right now, the uh, shop is open. Um, if you have your card swipe access, you can get in and you can get in here and work. Um, but if you're keeping an eye on the news, the, uh, uh, it's my, my pup pup, Bliss. Hi, pup. She came to help today. Um, this, uh, this virus is moving fast and they could shut this place down at any moment. So I would recommend setting yourself up at home. It'll be a good um, practice to have uh, yourself ready to transition for, for graduation and all of that. So that being said, I would recommend coming and getting your stuff that you have in the, in, in the storage cabinets here, the flat files and, and wherever else you found little cubby holes of, of putting your things so that you can be ready to, to print from home. But um, you are certainly welcome to come in and print as long as you can get in here. Um, for those of you in uh, the doing uh, advanced work in the screen print, um, I will um, make myself available for uh, one day late next week, maybe Thursday, I don't know, I'll get a hold of you all at some point, and so that you can uh, print out some transparencies to burn onto your screens. Um, and uh, so that you have, so, I know that you've been working on that stuff, so that you have that stuff uh, ready to go. Um, and you have uh, screens emulsioned and all of that. So I would come in and, and take care of all of that uh, as soon as you can um, so that if they shut this place down, you're not locked out of everything like that. So um, I, think, I think that, oh, one more thing. Um, I would like to treat this like the end of the semester um, just in case they do completely shut us out. And that would be me too. Um, uh, I have done my best to clean my office out of everything that I would need to, to completely work from home. But um, please, when you come in to get the kit that you have here, these supplies for you to work at home, please do uh, on your honor system some cleanup in the print shop. 
Uh, just like we would at the end of the semester, um, if you have made a big mess over in the sink areas, do some scrubbing over there, clean your areas up, uh, clean the presses up, make sure that everything is in good shape so that we don't um, uh, leave and come back to uh, some horrifying uh, remains. And uh, the last thing that I will say before I say goodbye is if you have stuff in the refrigerator, clear it out. If it's not cleared out by the end of next week, I'm tossing everything in there. There's already some nasty foul smelling stuff. Um, so it's, it's pretty nasty. So take care of it or I'm just going to get rid of all of it. All right. If you need anything, get a hold of me. Um, I'm learning how to use Zoom so we can do conferences that way or things like that. I don't know. All of this is new to me. Obviously, I am not tech savvy. So it's, a, it's been a crazy week uh, for me and I'm supposing for you all as well. Um, all right. That's it. Goodbye for now. Take care. Be safe. Stay away from everybody uh, except stay close uh, socially but not physically. Anyway, bye.